and welcome back. During today's vlog episode, I wanna to talk to you guys about what is prayer? How do you do it? How do you know when you're doing it? How do you know when it works? We're gonna talk about prayer, all the ins and outs. So I hope you stick around. I hope you enjoy this video. Let's get right into it. What's going on guys? So I am here with my uncle. This is Troy Thompson. Awesome man of God. And I wanted him to, to answer the question, what is prayer? So talk about what is prayer to you. Uh, I, it's, it's not religious, that's for sure. And it's not like, uh, so for me, it's, um, it's, it's the green light on Facebook. It's the, it's the constant on with God throughout the day. Um, it's just constantly communicating and communing with God. So it's, it's less about what I pray and it's more about listening for, for God to say stuff during the day, basically. Yeah. It's, and it's not about, you know, I think traditionally we've been taught that you have to pray certain things or certain times or a certain amount of time. Mm -hmm. And I just never, that's never been something I've been able to do. I don't, never been able to, to pray like consistently every day at a certain time because my life is so, yeah. um, just not, it just doesn't work like that. And I don't think anybody's life works like that. Mm -hmm. I mean, for the most part, like, or, nor do I think that God wants your obligation of a time slot, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. right. It's like saying you only get this to. amount of time. Yeah, like God, like, or month. like it's like saying that like your your wife or your girlfriend like mm -hmm. have to spend this fifteen minutes with you, right? right? So <laughs> just I, I've joking. never looked at it like that. I've always looked at it like I'm always on with God. So I, I find myself like just having conversations with God under my you know, just very under my breath and yeah. and I'll just you know I'll just say things like Lord I just thank you that I take that thought hostage and mm -hmm. Lord that you know a weapon formed against me and it doesn't matter if I'm in you know a line at Chipotle I'll, I'll say yeah. it and sometimes yeah. people will hear me and they'll look at me weird like, like oh, what, what was you that? talking to <laughs> yeah <laughs> but that's awesome but yeah so yeah that's just prayer it's prayer is just not not stopping your communication with with heaven uh, for any reason ever yeah. you know yeah that's good because I feel like a lot of times people just think that like prayer is a one way thing like when I pray I just just tell God stuff yeah. but like prayer is so much more where God talks to you and he responds and he gives you direction and being open and available to listen to that is prayer yeah like listening is prayer it's crazy but that's yeah, awesome I, like I don't I spend more time listening I guess yeah. I, you know that's a good thing to say like yeah I don't know I do less talking when I'm praying than most people think you would when you pray. Right. Like I may, I have a certain, so you know, I have declarations that I say right. every day, you know, but I don't, when I'm praying, most times there's just this still time when I'm listening. And, and most of my intense moments of prayer came, come from his affirmation to yeah. me, not my words to him. Right. And I think yeah. if people understood that, like, mm -hmm. when he affirms you with his word, and you learn to listen to that, dial into that, and that's when your identity is solidified, and mm -hmm. you, you know, you, you, there's a boldness and a confidence that comes on you in that. That's why you need to pray, right? Yeah, there. <laughs> that's right. Why you need yes. Right. No, that's yeah. so good. I love that because it's like, man, prayer. We think that we have an obligation to pray because God just needs to hear from us, but it's the opposite. Like, we have an obligation to pray because we need to hear from God. Like we need God's, his advice, his input in our life. So that's an awesome, like first way to start the video. First tip, prayer is not as much about what you say as what you hear from God. It's you, I love it. It's you. So just got home and this is by far my favorite part of every single day. Let me show you guys. We have someone very special waiting for us. Just finishing up the day here. We kind of cleaned the house a little bit and 
just had some family time and I just spent the last hour or two playing with this little girl and with Riley and as I ended the, as I end the video I just had the thought while I was playing with Riley when you think about prayer when you talk about prayer and what your prayer life should look like I personally think it should look like a father interacting with his children you know I just spent the last hour chasing my daughter around the house tickling her having fun and and although prayer has a more serious tone to it the heart of prayer is just that it's it's interacting and living your life with your with your father which is God and he loves you he, he wants to hang out with you he wants to spend time with you he wants to know the things that are on your heart and most importantly like what we talked about today you need to know the things that are on his heart what he says about you what he thinks about you and prayer is just that it's just that simple connection that conversation that you can have with the Lord where you just you, you tell you talk to him you know a lot of people overcomplicate it. It doesn't have to be complicated. Just take some time out of your day to talk with God, to listen to what He has to say, and to allow Him to hear the things that are on your heart. So I hope you enjoyed that video. If you have any questions or ideas for future videos, leave them in the comments below. If you have anything that you would like to see me talk about, leave that below as well. As we wrap up this video, you know the drill. Remember, live right, love everyone, and pray hard. We'll see you guys next time.